Hey everybody, so today's video is going to be the back to school tag and yeah, I'm actually kind of in my pajamas. I mean, I know it maybe doesn't look like it, but um, yeah, I'm in a super neon top, so that might be why the camera is a little bit weird. Um, but yeah, and you guys can see I'm actually sitting on my bed. This is the first video that I've ever done where I'm like facing my bed and I discovered a really ghetto way of how to set up my lights because there's not really a light switch or a plug um, close enough for my left lamp or I guess it'd be right for you um, but yeah so I found a ghetto way but whatever we're here I just think that it's so much more chill I have my stuffed animals back there but you know whatever wanted to switch it up a little bit um, so yeah this is the back to school tag well, I guess I shouldn't say this is the back to school tag because this is actually like a mashup. I took two different tags, one more beauty related and more that was just like straightforward, like, oh, about your school life, and um, put them together because I think that they're from the beauty tag, there were some like important questions that were missing. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and jump into it. I, I combined 16 questions. Let me grab my tea. See, I'm just in like pajamas. Um, yeah. I got my tea and my Hello Kitty mug. So cute. Um, but yeah, number one, what grade are you going into? I am going into 12th grade. I'm going to be a senior in high school. Yes, I am not 13, you guys. Um, I should do a whole entire video about my age and stuff. But yeah, I'm going to be a senior in high school. Crazy. Number two, when do you go back to school? I go back to school August 26th. Yeah, that's right. Um... So yeah, I don't know when this video will be up, um, should be before that, maybe the day before, I don't know, whatever, you guys will be seeing it sometime. Number three, what's your favorite part of getting ready for back to school? Definitely the shopping and getting supplies ready. Oh, and getting, I mean this isn't really getting ready, but like getting schedules and stuff, I think that's so fun. Number four, what are you excited and nervous for this year? Well, I'm excited that it is my senior year. I don't actually have to go the whole day. I get out of school early. Um, I'm nervous for the English graduation project. We have to do our um, our product, and I'm kind of nervous about that, but um, I don't know. Not too nervous. I don't think it's going to be that hard this year, even though, well, if you want me to do a whole entire video about my schedule, I definitely can, um, but that's up to you guys. Number four, sorry, I already did that one. Number five, are you taking any honors classes? Yes. Yes, I am. Like I said, if you want me to do a schedule video, I will talk all about that. Um, and these questions are kind of like short, so just, I, I don't know why I needed to put that in there, but whatever. Number six, do you sleep in class? No. Number seven, do you text in class? Rarely. Um, obviously, we're not like allowed to text in class or whatever, but sometimes if, say, there's like a sub, I'll text my mom or um, a friend or just go on my phone. Um, so, yeah. Number eight, do you have lockers? Yes, we do have lockers at school, but almost no one has them. I've never had one in high school. Number nine, do you have a dress code? Yes. Um, nothing crazy like I've heard. I've heard some like UK people like in the comments. Um, of like other people's videos say like they couldn't wear makeup or I heard someone, I forget who it was, say like they couldn't wear flip flops to school. Um, I think that's kind of crazy. But yeah, um, basically our dress code is um, your short skirts and dresses have to be like fingertip length, which means that when you stand up straight and put your hands down next to your side, your skirt has to go down to at least your fingertips. I don't know who actually follows that, especially with shorts, but that's what it is. And, um, you're not technically supposed to wear tank tops, but, I mean, I don't know anybody who actually wears, like, spaghetti strap tank tops, but, I mean, people don't really get caught. Um, last year, the big thing for dress code was that you weren't allowed to wear yoga pants or leggings, like, as pants. I mean, obviously, if you were wearing them, like, under, like, a dress or something, that was fine, but, um, they finally changed that because everybody would wear yoga pants. I mean, everybody. Um... So, the dress code now says that you can wear leggings and yoga pants, like as pants, as long as your backside is covered. So, basically how I would wear them, you know, with like a longer top. So, 
We basically have no dress code. People just wear what they want. Yeah. Number 10, do you walk, drive, ride the bus, or get picked up? I walk to and from school. I actually live, like, right across from my school. Uh, it takes me, like, less than 10 minutes to get home. Number 11, do you dress up or wear sweats? I have never worn sweatpants to school. I mean, I guess that's a lie. I have, like, once or twice, but um, those are dates that I've been, like, really sick. So, you guys know, if you watch my outfit of the weeks, I dress up, like, all the time. And people are always, like... Oh, what are you dressed up for? Is there an event today? And I'm like, nope. It's just me. I love dressing up. It's so fun. Number 12, a study or party all night. I have actually never been to a party in high school. I'm a loner. I mean, like, seriously, I have, like, no friends. But, yeah. I mean, I guess study, even though I don't really study. I know that's bad, but I don't know. It's gotten me through. Number 13, do you plan your outfits before or do you decide the day of? Well, I'm assuming this is like day before school and I definitely plan it out. Um, usually I plan it out very far in advance, like a, like a week or something. But this year, I honestly am clueless. I don't know what I'm going to wear because the weather is really weird here in Charlotte. It's like, I mean, just looking outside, it looks like gloomy. I mean, the leaves are already starting to fall. It's basically like fall or autumn here. It's, like, between, like, the 60s and the 70s, it's not summer here. It's weird. And when you go outside, it's, like, cold. So I don't know if I'm going to be wearing, like, jeans on the first day of school or if it's going to be, like, a skirt or a dress type of thing. I'm really not sure yet. Um, I'm going to have to wait and see what the weather is going to be like. Sorry, I had a fuzz. And my lip gloss. That's great. Number 14, top 14. 14, top three backpack essentials that are beauty. Um, I always have, let's see, really I only have like a lip product to apply. Usually I have a Revlon lip butter in there or a Maybelline Color Whisper. I'm not sure though as for this year, um, I'm thinking about doing like a shop my stash video, but I'm thinking that I'm going to be putting like lip gloss in there because I have so many but I'm not going to be there the whole day at school, so I'm not sure if I'm even going to need to touch up. Um, but I would also bring, like, blotting sheets, and um, I always had, like, a roller ball. Um, I never really used it, but it's nice to have. And that's pretty much it. I don't really touch up anything else. Number 15, what is your best quick fix for makeup during school? I would definitely say reapplying your lip product, whether it's, like, after gym or after lunch or just when it fades off because um, I wear a lot of bright lipstick to school so for me it's kind of essential to touch up or you get like that dark line around your lips that is not cute so I would definitely say lip products or like blotting or um, like powdering your face again so you don't get too shiny and number 16 last but not least where or from whom do you like getting inspiration for back to school trends and styles honestly it <sighs> It's like so random. I just get ideas. Um, mostly though, it is from like Instagram, sorry, or other YouTubers um, seeing their style. Let's see. There's someone and I can't even think of who it is right now. Oh, well... Um, I guess I would say like Lauren Elizabeth, um, Carly Chrisman. I've gotten a few pieces that are definitely Carly Chrisman inspired. And yeah, I mean different celebrities I guess, but mostly people on like YouTube and Instagram, like real people. Um, I definitely don't get inspiration from my school. People at my school are so either preppy and wear Jack Rogers and Chevron printed dresses um, with a monogram on it. Or they bum it out and um, just wear sweats, so yeah, I do my own thing, which is great. But yeah, so I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, I think I'm gonna actually try to venture outside and do an empties video, because somehow I've acquired enough stuff to do one. I don't know how, it hasn't been that long, but yeah. I don't know, I'm kinda scared. I might have to put like a sweater, like a long sleeve shirt on. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please tell me um, what grade you are going into. I would love to know. Um, I think that's so interesting. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.